Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Doc Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSE Mathematics today, class 7, chapter 19, speed, time and distance exercise 19, B question number 2. And this is if train with a speed of 60 km per hour crosses a pole in 30 seconds, what is the length of the train in meters, right? So suppose this is my train and this is a pole. So it's crossing that pole here in how much time? 30 seconds. Fine. So 30 seconds is the time that is taken by the train to cross a, a, a pole completely. That is this end will come here and the back end, the okay, this one from at the very end, this will also come right after the pole. This is when the train has completely crossed the pole. Fine. Not in the middle or not in the starting only. Fine. Now you see that the speed of the train is given to us. But first of all, one thing is very important that what really will be the distance, uh, length of the train. Fine. So that will be what? So remember that I told you in the previous video as well that the length of the train, right, equals to the distance traveled by train, right? So this will be the length of the train. That is the distance it has traveled. But this is only uh, used when uh, the train is crossing a pole or something like that which has uh, not which which is not really that long right we can simply just ignore the length of that thing like there's poles right okay but if the train is crossing some bridge or something else like that then we have different method for that right that we will see in the upcoming videos but for now just know this that if the train is crossing a pole the length of the train will be the distance travel by it right so first of all we have the what do we have we have speed in kilometer per hour 60 kilometers per hour we have time in seconds 30 seconds so analyze it and you'll see that the units are not the same so we'll make the units same so let's see what shall we convert let's convert kilometer per hour into seconds meter per seconds right so the speed is 60 kilometers per hour and that will be converted to meter per second so 60 into 5 by 18 this becomes 9 this becomes 30 this will cut it again 3 and 10 so 50 by 3 and what it will it be meter per second all right so this becomes the speed now we'll see the time time is given to us in seconds so there's nothing to change in this right that becomes what 30 seconds fine or you can call it half a minute as well but we don't have to do that right now we don't need to do that fine so uh, now we'll see the distance fine now this is the final step that we have to do because the distance traveled by the train equals to the length of the train so do that so distance becomes what speed into time that gives us what speed is 50 by 3 meter per seconds into time is what 30 seconds into 3 0 so 3 and 30 cut each other 1 and 0 right so 5 uh, so 50 into 10 becomes 500 meters right and that becomes the final answer this is the length of the train fine and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and leave a like on this one till then take good care of yourself and bye bye